Um, normally, the most common presentations are rib fractures and bruising to the chest, so fairly minor chest trauma. Uh, the problem for emergency physicians is that sometimes patients who appear to have relatively minor chest trauma turn out to have major uh, trauma, so that they uh, have underlying uh, chest injuries, such as uh, heart injuries to the heart or lungs, and that is not always obvious uh, when they first present. Resuscitative thoracotomy, uh, which is which is something that uh, has been, I guess, something that has come into vogue and gone out of vogue. But with the advent of the FAST scan, that's the ultrasound of the heart, in the emergency department, um, we can more accurately diagnose those patients who are likely to benefit from resuscitative thoracotomy. In patients with chest trauma, the most common mistakes are um, uh, in terms of things that kill people uh, are missing injuries, so uh, injuries such as um, aortic transection, um, uh, missing tension pneumothorax, um, and, uh, and, the, and the, the, the most common mistake uh, that, that happens down the track is that we see a patient with a rib fracture, we send them to the ward and they don't get adequate analgesia those patients go on and develop uh, pneumonia and some of them die, especially the elderly patients. So the under-recognition of um, adequate analgesia is probably the most common cause of uh, preventable death uh, in, in, in this group of patients.